Ja, ja, ja. Everybody done had their first kiss. I hope I'm right about that. Hey, if you ain't had your first kiss, ah, shit. But let me tell y'all about mine. So look, y'all, you feel me? This, in all honesty, this could be like a 30-second story time. I ain't even going to fake it with y'all. But knowing the type nigga I am, I'm going to give y'all a little bit more. I'm going to really visualize this for y'all. I'm going to put it into detail for y'all and tell y'all all the situations leading up to this moment. So basically, it was this party, you feel me? Me and all the guys went. It was a little party. It was, you feel me? Our friend. I'm not going to say his name. We're going to name him C. This nigga got a big ass house. Like a, like a mansion. Like a mansion ass type ass fat ass house. And everybody like, that was like the little spot when we was young. Like we used to always go there. And I'm in eighth grade, you feel me? And so one, one, the first problem was... This nigga invited way more boys than the girls, like, on some sausage party shit. So, boom. We all, like, we all there. It was boring at first. I'm not even gonna lie. It was kind of boring at first until, like, shit started getting, like, we started getting to the juicy shit. So, it was about eight of us. About eight of us and three girls. Really, technically, only two. Cause the other girl don't count cause she came in uh she came there with her boyfriend. So she was already off the hook. Nigga. So it was really only two girls. What the fuck is eight boys gonna do with two girls? So that was already the first problem. But fast forward, we get into the basement. And this is where we start getting to the the juicy shit. And feel me, we get to plan two for dare. So it was only two girls available. I'm not even gonna cat with you. But it get the uh who's there was it? Was it me or the girls? It get to the girl, the girl that I kiss, it get to her there. Motherfuckers, you know how it be. Oh, I dare you to kiss QJ, I dare you this and that and the third. Now, you feel me? You know me, nigga. I'm young charming. I'm young, yeah, so I'm ready. I'm like, yeah, I'm looking at the bros like mm-hmm. So you already know what went down. So we getting that corner. We getting that corner. Boy, we getting that corner. Man, you feel me, nigga? Lick them lips, nigga. Easy shit, nigga. Easy shit, you feel me? And she can't never cap, like, on some shit. I don't know. Hey, she got a boyfriend now. She type fucking, no, that never. Nope. Got your ass on camp. But no, no, that was just my first kiss. Now, really, I could have told that story in, like, 30 seconds. But you feel me? I had to keep it a hundred with y'all and you feel me visualize that shit for y'all so niggas won't have no 30 second video and i'm glad niggas ended up getting a little bit of action because at the start i'm like oh shit i'm out of care for no reason niggas was we was watching this scary ass movie i think it was it i think it was it too we was watching this scary ass movie bro i'm in this bitch with no covers niggas was already got the hollering at the females I'm like, yo, what the fuck? I need a shoulder to lean on. Like, come fuck with a bread. When are you fucking with the lames? Like, nigga, when you give, you give v Long some love. On some real shit, I don't want to be looking like no lonely ass dork. Niggas, only two females. Niggas done already tried to make their move and shit. Like, goddamn. But yeah, so niggas still ended up getting some action. But after that, fucking, the girl that I kissed ended up kissing, like, dude whose house it was. And then other dude too I'm not gonna say who it was He ended up kissing like two, two niggas after me She was like I don't wanna, I don't wanna look like a thought Girl you might as well embrace yourself All them lips you putting your lips on You might as well just embrace yourself Not trying to act like what you're not On some real stuff You done already did the D You trying to Oh I'm not trying to look like a, a, no thought though Cause y'all Hey girl you might as well Like real spill but other girl that was there i ended up i ain't uh kiss her none i ain't like do nothing with her she ended up kissing uh the two other dudes i think no 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 she ended up kissing my homeboy them mother hey shout out my nigga b5 i know you're gonna be watching this shit shout out my nigga b5 she ended up i'm a hold on hold on that's gonna be later in the story i'm gonna really get into that for y'all so the girl that i kissed uh yeah 
up kids, two other motherfuckers. Uh, dude, who house it was, my nigga C. Nigga, she end up, he ended up taking her upstairs. And fuck, I don't think this nigga like, about to, nigga about to crack cheeks. Cause he, they was both a uh, grade below me. I'm in eighth grade and seventh grade. I'm thinking this nigga about to crack cheeks. I'm looking kind of jealous. Like, I don't want to do something like that. Cause let me describe her for y'all. So nigga, she was like, she had like a motherfucking like a, like a jelly butt, like a, like her shit was like so fat. Like in seventh grade, I'm like, oh whoa, like how did it just get that way already? Like her shit was like so like, I don't know, like her fucking butt was like a Nicki Minaj, like a white Nicki Minaj, like an Iggy Azalea or some shit, but her legs didn't match her butt, so it was weird, but her butt was like so big, and she had, uh, this one she had, what, brown hair, so yeah, she had brown hair, she had braces, and me, nigga, I thought she was so cold back in them days, like, you feel me? Still looking back at it, like, nigga, she was cold. Now, all my homeboys, all my niggas be like, nah, bro, like, you tripping, but nigga. Me, hey, nigga, she was cold. So then, let's get uh into my nigga B5. So my nigga B5 take Suri to the living room. My nigga take Suri to the living room. Now, we young, immature ass niggas, so we low key, like, have cock blocking <laughs> on some, like, on some fucking nosy shit. Like, what the fuck is they doing upstairs? So nigga, me and my niggas, we tiptoe, we tiptoe, tiptoe, nigga from the basement to uh, the living room, nigga, my nigga B5 being active, this one, my nigga was like a good, like, what, he was like 4'6", my nigga was like 4'6", and I had no hair, my nigga was getting active, my, I'm talking about a uh, tongue in her, like, then you hear straight tongue. So I see my nigga putting his straight tongue action, nigga, and them motherfuckers down there about to fuck. I'm like, oh shit. So nigga, I'm oh shit, nigga. I'm looking at my niggas like, yeah. So nigga, I walk up uh to the living room. Like, what the fuck y'all niggas doing? And then them motherfuckers got the they got the lucky looking at me like, you cock block guys, nigga. <laughs> hey, I was a little fucking. Hey, I'm so sorry, bro. My nigga could have been smashing some shit. Every day, I'm so sorry, brother. But nigga, you feel me? Hey, you you will get your lick back. You'll get your lick back on me for that, nigga. Anytime. But yeah, so then see that nigga, uh, the girl that I kissed when he had took her upstairs back to that. That nigga ain't do nothing either. So really, we didn't really get no action besides like we was making out with females and kissing them. So we didn't really get no action for real. So yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed that story time. I've been trying to. I don't know if y'all want the story times long or short. I've been trying to keep these hoes short. I know the last story time was like ten minutes. But if y'all like these long videos, just let me know down in the comment section, man. I'm gonna just keep these hoes pumping out for y'all every Saturday, man. So, you can go ahead, subscribe, like, comment, and share with y'all friends, man, so we can hit the YouTube algorithm. And I'm out, man. Peace.